In this video, we'll look at whether barium hydroxide, that's BaOH2, is soluble or insoluble in water. This is a bit of a tricky one. So let's first look at the solubility rules here. If we look down the solubility rules, the most relevant one is that most hydroxide salts are only slightly soluble. And these are some exceptions, some group one elements and the ammonium ion, like ammonium hydroxide. So according to these rules, it's only slightly soluble. But if we were to consult a solubility chart, we find barium right here and hydroxide right here. So we go over and down, we see an S. That means soluble. So we have two answers here, slightly soluble and soluble. And barium hydroxide is kind of in between. It is slightly soluble, but it's also a strong base. Let's take a look at that. So this is a list of common strong acids and strong bases good list to memorize. So you look down the list, you see barium hydroxide, that's considered a strong base. So we said it was slightly soluble or according to our chart, soluble. What it means to be a strong base is the part of this that dissolves, the portion of the barium hydroxide that dissolves in water is going to dissociate completely. It's going to split apart into Ba2 plus ions and hydroxide ions, OH minus. So we consider it a strong base. Because it's a strong base in terms of solubility, when we do things like net ionic equations, we'll split this apart into its ions. We'll treat it like it's soluble. So in general, barium hydroxide is considered to be a soluble compound, but it's not a super soluble compound like sodium nitrate. It's soluble, but not to a great extent. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.